it's the seventh ranked Florida Gators and the fourth ranked Alabama Crimson Tide from the Rhodes House in Tuscaloosa. A couple of teams tied for first get place in the SEC with two games left to go in the regular season. It was awesome. You know, first I'd like to thank all the fans. They were incredible. They brought great energy and definitely helped out uh, with our win today. Uh, but, you know, you got to credit Jackie Trainer first of all. Come back, throw back-to-back -back games in uh, probably the worst heat of the year so far. Uh, I was hoping that, you know, she's a Naples kid and I think she likes the heat, but I was hoping it wouldn't sap her energy. But, you know, she kept going out there and putting up zeros. And, uh, you know, our early runs really helped her out, I thought. First pitch to Taylor Hunt, high fly ball on the left field line, gone! A home run! 17th of the season for Kayla Hunt. And Bama takes a one to nothing lead here in the bottom of the second. You know, Hunt, she was out for a week with a with an injury that she suffered at Georgia. So we've been watching her get better and better slowly in practice. And I think it was the first pitch of that at bat that she clobbered over the left field fence. But the key to me was we didn't just sit on the home run. We continued that inning. And uh, Courtney Conley gets up with second and third and two outs and gets a single up the middle to score those two. And then kind of gives us a good cushion. And then going into the, the next inning, we score the five. So. Uh, both of those, in those innings were key to me. For a team that uh, in the preseason, we didn't get one first place vote in the preseason poll by any of the other coaches. Uh, we had 15 returnees. We had a first team All-American in Jackie Tran. And I, you know, I think we all took it as kind of a um, motivating factor throughout the season. And for them to do it, I'm very happy for the seniors to win three in a row. I'm really happy for uh, the freshmen to win their first one. And then, um, you know, I'm happy for the fans that we could bring this back to Tuscaloosa.